Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I decided to combine two small topics. Firstly, I'll explain the importance of Absus Illusion equipment and then I'm gonna show you how to get perfect Yorgos weapon. But before we get started, I recommend to subscribe, because here on this channel you will find various content regarding the world of Ion. I also appreciate if you like this video and leave a comment. Such things help reaching YouTube recommendations. Let's begin with Absus Illusion equipment. It's also new gear from patch 8.0. However, it's not an entire set. Developers designed just one piece of equipment for each class. And if you take a look at the table, you can see Absus Illusion has better stats compared with Fighting Spirit gear parts. So far there is only one way how to obtain Absus Illusion gear parts. They drop from New World Boss. And if you watched my quick guide about Absaranta, you already know details about this boss. And by the way, in the future patch, which is 8.2, it will be possible to obtain Absus Illusion gear through Lord's Relic system. In terms of enchantment, Absus Illusion equipment provides absolutely the same bonuses as Fighting Spirit gear. You can enchant it up to plus 15 using PV enchantment stones. Apart from better stats, Absus Illusion equipment also has one interesting feature. Upon extraction, it gives slot stones and Aya crystals. But I personally believe getting Aya crystals in this way is not something you should be doing. And now let's talk about perfect Yorgos weapon. In 8.0, you can obtain it by upgrading tier 3 Yorgos weapon. For this you will need 500 pieces of Master Essence and the same number of Insignias of Experience. These requirements are absolutely legit, because getting tier 4 Yorgos weapon is guaranteed, so you don't have to face RNG over and over again. Now a very important fact, uh, and I know a lot of people have been asking me about it. So when upgrading tier 3 into tier 4, you keep the Arms Fusion. In translation from Korean, tier 4 Yorgos weapons are called perfect. In terms of stats, they have 500 more attack than tier 3. The rest of stats, including passive skill, remain the same. However, there is one more advantage over tier 3. You can use WoW stones and apply an appearance skill on top of Yorgos passive skill. So eventually, you can have two skills on this weapon. Details regarding WoW system will be provided in a separate video. Now you probably wonder if there are any changes in farming the essences in 8.0. According to Korean patch notes, legendary weapons should drop more often from instances. Moreover, an additional way of getting legendary Yorgos weapon will be also provided. It will be possible to obtain it from named monsters in Calder. And that's all the info I wanted to tell you today. If you have any questions about the game, feel free to ask them in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video with your friends. Keep in mind, I really appreciate if you support the channel via donations. It's a strong motivation for me to keep doing these videos. If you wanna donate, check the links in description. Thanks for watching and see you soon.